Blinding Sphere is a really good move, by the way. I had totally underestimated it on our last playthrough. It is a very good option to attack Dark. Save me, please! To sit upon that throne means embracing the needs of the many and forsaking the needs of the one. To rule is to accept a lonely life. The king must discard his own sense of self. It was too much for me. Indeed. Luger, I leave the rest to you. <laughs> Gaius likes decisiveness. Well done. job back there. So that was a fractured dimension. It's true. I spent many sleepless nights wondering whether I should abdicate the throne for Carla's sake. But when it was all said and done, I chose to remain king. Do you know why? Because you liked ruling? <laughs> Spoken like a true Olympian. But I suppose you are right in a way. I cherish my contact with people. It's a source of great personal strength. I suppose that a king's duty to offer guidance to his people is what appealed to me about leadership in the first place. Mark my words, Luger. There's a lesson for you in this. Destroying worlds requires a sense of detachment, one that will corrode the strongest of souls. If you continue to fight on your own, the isolation will consume you someday. <laughs> Isolation means being alone, right? So there's no problem because Luger's got all of us. That's big talk from a little girl. Talking is my speciality. Hmm? You know, Gaius, they say the more the merrier about a lot of things, including support. His support skill's not very good. I suppose you're right. Feel free to call on me if you ever need help. Or if you just feel like grabbing a drink. Wow, nicely done, Luger. It's not every day you become drinking buddies with a king. You picking up the tab? No, we'll split the bill evenly. <laughs> Guess you're not that close of a buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Man. I'll be an old lady before I can finally publish this story about Gaius. You okay with that? Guess I gotta be. He's not the easiest guy to read, but I know there's a lot going on in that head of his. If I put in the time and effort, I know I'll figure out what makes Gaius tick eventually. Kinda the same with you. But don't worry, I'm not gonna write some trashy tell-all, you know. Gaius's trial is never ending, though. Nice one. <laughs> Rummage through Beasley's desk now, immediately. <laughs> on a little business myself. What kind of business? A oh, different kind. I'm a mighty busy girl. Hassling you isn't my only job, you know. I feel ya. I've got a lot going on, too. <sighs> so... So... 
What do you say, hmm, Drellin is okay, the uh, best weapon shops in the game, right? <laughs> I appreciate the offer, but I'll pass. Uh, I don't think so. Hey, I like your clothes. Where would be better? Looks like you and I see oh, eye to when it comes to fashion. Just to be clear, yeah. I have no intention of growing a beard. Everyone is staring. I'm sorry to worry their gazes. I think too the shops really? get upgraded at uh Jean Well yeah, the upgraded well. Jean Du and uh Triglyph picks up Would upgrades. You take a look at my GHS for me. It uh, appears to be broken. What? I need to insert some sort of power source, you say? <laughs> Why is it that you Olympians are so good with machines? What? Most? This shop, I don't think, upgrades. Do Riza Maxians are good with them as well? What exactly do you mean by that? Here, why don't I send you my GHS address? <laughs> Aha! At long last, I have mastered the art of contact sharing. <laughs> Look at that. We've racked up 50,000 chips already. Huh? We just got the complete <laughs> party, so... Have? Nothing. I was just in awe of your ability to count a pile of money at a single glance. That's a very Alvin skill. We sure have brought down a lot of these elite monsters. Yeah. The first time I laid eyes on one, I thought we were doomed. But somehow we did it! I, for one, don't like them one bit. They're so big and disgusting. They're elite gross! You know, if you were that size, you'd be pretty gross too. How did this become about me? That isn't true at all. It is true. It's elite true. Oh yeah? Well, you're an elite jerk. This is flying out of control fast, Luger. Like, way out of control. Time to step in? I know which one makes guys happier. <laughs> I know which one makes Elise happier. <laughs> Stop it, guys. What happened to the teamwork we used to beat the elite monsters? Great point. Oh. Did you guys hear what Luger just said? The teamwork was hardly necessary. Elite monsters are on the level of something you'd hunt alone as a training <laughs> exercise. Yes, well, you're special, so stay out of this. I will not. I have more to say. Tipo, if you were the size of a house, you would be all the more adorable. A Tipo house? I've never thought of that before. Oh, wow. A soft, squishy house like that? That's so cute. I would totally live there. Elise, Tipo, I was mistaken. I am so sorry. I accept your apology. Matter. Gaius saves the day again. <laughs> Resolved. That Gaius. Did he intend this outcome all along? <laughs> <laughs> so, what do we need for that first one? Three Everbloom. Meeting with Julius. <laughs> so we've got a lot of stuff to do now we're gonna be at this for a little while I think I'm tired so yeah 
we're going to be starting up next time with a ton of Yeah, monsters. we're going to kill a bunch of elite monsters. We're going to explore literally half of Rize Maxia. We will need to make up our mind about where we're going to go shop and probably upgrade all our weapons and such again. Yep. Out of curiosity, before we sign off, what's our next debt payment? 150? I mean, we'll hit that oh, easily. We'll hit yeah, that we have a ton easy. to do, but I just wanted to know.